all of college influenced my career. I had never been on an airplane. I'd never been outside of New Orleans. And I remember showing up at Columbia University in New York um, the first day and just being completely intimidated. I think, I think understanding that I could actually survive in that atmosphere and understanding that New York is a place that I could sort of control in a way um, was just a great experience and gave me confidence. It broadened my world. I mean, I grew up in an all-African-American neighborhood in the South. I show up in New York. Um, and it broadened my world. I got to meet people I'd never would have met before. Um, I was forced to read as part of the Common Core books that I wouldn't have read before. Um, and I realized I could compete with everybody, but mainly I just saw that the world was bigger than the world I grew up in. So when I was a young reporter in New Orleans, I was attached to an investigative team. Um, and I learned how to do all this exotic stuff, look at public records and do all of this amazing stuff but I didn't learn how to write a news story. And one day a very kind editor named Jack Davis, who's still around, um, sat down with me and he said, you can do all this great stuff, but if you don't stop and learn how to do the basics and just go back to zero and start covering cops and courts, you're never gonna really be what you can be. Um, he was right. Um, I'm glad I was humble enough at the time to understand he was right, but he put it the right way, and I think that was transformational for me. It's really important um, for the mentor and the mentee. First, it's important that other people get the opportunities you get. I think the world is complicated. I think that big bureaucracies are complicated. I think it's helpful to have somebody help you navigate bureaucracies. But I also think for me, when I help somebody who's a lot younger than I am, which most people are now, um, that's great for me. It opens my mind to other things too. I think if universities can sort of go back to their original charter, which is to just to help people think critically and to help people separate sort of the wheat from the chaff and to help people just sort of understand the difference between things that are grounded in fact and things that are speculative and things that are just made up. I think if universities can spend more time helping people understand how to read the news, understand the news, I think that would be a, a tremendous value going forward to the country. And I know it doesn't matter to me what the political perspective is. What matters is that I think there are too many people in, the, in this country and in the world who just can't tell the difference or either don't look hard enough for the difference. Mm -hmm.